Hello everyone, welcome to solve this math Olympiad algebra problem and here we have m plus n equals to 2 and m times of n equals to 3 and we solve this problem for the values of m to the power of 5 plus n to the power of 5. So here we find the value of this expression and now first we focus on uh, these two equations and we call this is our equation number 1 and we call this is our equation number 2. So here first we focus on equation number 1 and now we just uh, uh, taking uh, squaring on equation number 1 uh, on both of the sides. Okay. We take squaring on this equation on both of the sides. So when you take squaring on this equation it is written as m plus n whole square equals to 2 square and here you see that uh, in the left hand side we have m plus n whole square this is a very well known famous identity and we know about this identity it is stated as m square plus 2 times of m n plus n square equals to 2 square and we know that 2 square equals to 4 and now in the next step uh, we have uh, m square plus from equation number 2 uh, we have the value of m n equals to 3 we use this value of m n here and it is written as 2 times of 3 plus n square equals to 4 and now uh, further uh, we have m square plus n square and this is 3 to the 6 and this whole equation equals to 4 and now uh, further we move this plus 6 to the right hand side and it is written as m square plus n square equals to 4 minus 6 and here we have 4 minus 6 is equals to minus 2 and we have m square plus n square equals to minus 2 and now we call this is our equation number 3 and now uh, in the next step uh, we uh, just again focus on equation number 1 and we uh, now we take uh, the cube on equation number 1 on both of the sides so here we just write that taking cube on uh, equation number 1 on both of the sides so we now we take a cube on both of the sides of equation number one and it is written as m plus n cubed is equals to 2 cubed so here we uh, use the nice uh, famous cubic identity and we know about this cubic identity uh, a cubed a m plus n cubed is equals to m cubed plus n cubed plus 2 times of m into n into m plus n equals to this is 2 cubed and 2 cubed equals to 8 and now uh, next again we need uh, to use equation number 1 and 2 here so that when we use equation number 1 and 2 so we just write that equation number 1 and 2 implies that so from equation number 1 we have the value of m plus n is 2 and from equation number 2 we have the value of m and n is 3 so we use these two values here and it is written as m cubed plus n cubed plus 2 times of 3 into 2 equals to 8 so here we need some simplifications and we write it as m cubed plus n cubed plus this is 2 times of 3 becomes here uh, sorry this is uh, 3 times of m n okay a cubed plus b cubed plus 3 times of a b sorry this is our 3 so this is 3 times of 3 is 9 and 9 to the 18 and it is equals to 8 and now here we move this plus 18 to the right hand side and it is written as m cubed plus n cubed equals to 8 minus 18 and now here further we uh, focus on this equation and here we have the value of m cubed plus n cubed equals to minus 10 
and we call this is our equation number four and now in this question uh, because we find the value of uh, m to the power of 5 plus n to the power of 5 we need to find the value of this expression so that in order to make the exponent of m and n is 5 here we just multiply uh, equation number 3 and equation number 4 each other okay here we multiply these two equations and when uh, here when we multiply equation number 3 and equation number 4 it means that we multiply left hand side with the left hand side and right hand side with right hand side so here we have the left hand side of equation number 3 is m square into n square and the left hand side of equation number 4 is uh, m cubed plus uh, n cubed and uh, the right hand side of equation number 3 is minus 2 and equation number 4 is minus 10. So here we uh, just multiply this uh, m square on both of these values. So when you multiply this m square with m cubed it is written as m to the power of 5 and when we multiply this m square with n cubed it is written as m square into n cubed. Similarly, we multiply this n square with these two values and it is written as n square into m cubed plus this n square times of n cubed equals to n to the power of 5 and this minus times of minus becomes plus and 2 tens are 20. And now uh, in, the next, in the next step uh, here we rearrange the terms. First we write the term of exponent 5. And these are m to the power of 5 plus n to the power of 5. And here we take common m square and n square from both of these terms. So when you take common m square n square, here we get only n and here we get only m and this whole equals to 20. So here we need a uh, uh, to rewrite this equation and we write it as uh, m to the power of 5 plus n to the power of 5 plus here we have m square n square and we write it as m n and its whole square and we write this as m plus n equals to 20. So here we again use equation number 1 and equation number 2. So these two equations also uh, again implies that uh, this is the value of m plus n is 2 and the value of m n is 3. So we use these two values here and it is written as m to the power of 5 plus n to the power of 5 plus 3 square into 2 equals to 20. And we know that 3 square equals to 9 and 9 twos are 18. So you get m to the power of 5 plus n to the power of 5 plus 18 equals to 20. And we move this 18 to the right hand side and it is written as m to the power of 5 plus n to the power of 5 equals to 20 minus 18 becomes here 2. So this is the final answer of this question. And thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.